Okay, welcome, welcome. <clears throat> Alright, let's get back to it. Last night, I was actually got a little bit lost, but now I think I know where exactly I'm supposed to be, so hopefully don't embarrass myself again. Okay, let's see. Let's find this guard captain. Probably... We're over here. Straight ahead, so let's go. Chef? Find a captain. Oh. 
Again meddle with the supernal dreamers? Taste the flames of oblivion. Oh, this little thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, my minions. Slash and rend. Oh, come on. You little ass don't need to stop. Huh? Who else got something? Why won't you die? <laughs> Remember his name. Die. Oh, you big boy. This seems very awful for a very good time. Alright, buddy, get up. What happened? I have to get to Koglin Village. Meet me there. An undead werewolf <laughs> took over Camelot. An undead werewolf? How does that even work? They killed them all! Those Daedric filth killed my entire patrol. Then they dragged me off and threw me into a nightmare. Vermina. They kept saying Vermina. Vermina? What that means. High King Emric needs to know about this cult. With their nightmare magic, these Daedric madmen could plunge Stormhaven into chaos. But you. Thank you for saving me. Well, let's see. As soon as I recover, I'm going to Wayrest. I have to warn the king about these people. These supernal dreamers. Yeah, what do you know about Vermina? No more than most men. She's the Daedric Prince of Nightmares and Evil Dreams. She's... Horrible, but some people actually worship her. I don't know, but it can't be good. They're up there calling on Vermina, the Daedric Prince of Nightmares, putting me to sleep and talking about summoning something. If it's what I saw in my dreams, it's something terrible. Without a doubt. I even heard King Emmerich's name. We need to warn him. We need to warn everyone. I told the village constable, but he's more worried about these slavers. He doesn't understand. These people worship Vermina. I mean, slavers are pretty bad, too. Well, let's... Fine goods at fair prices. Uh... 
As soon as I recover, I'm going to Wayrest. I have to warn the king of... Okay, so... Wayrest. Where is this going down? Flame and stole that armor. I don't know. I could have sworn I'd seen her up at Castle Alacair. You think the constable would lock up a real Knight of the Flame? But you have to admit, he has been acting strange lately. I'll admit I was surprised he broke up with Sylvisa. She's gorgeous. See, now I'm kind of confused about where I'm going. I'd be careful you don't say that too long. I heard Sylvisa was once quite a swordsman. I'm just joking around. I'm a happily married man. You know, underneath all that steel, that knight actually has a pretty attractive finger. Prices have never been better. Uh, I'm that's. Thought I had everything here. Okay, so according to this, once you're done with Lenumdra, which I just finished, story, you move on to Stormhaven. Yeah, I'm a bit confused about where the hell this is going next. Uh, well, let's just pick something. Yay. I'm not there yet. The plan. Keep this one. of the flame and stole that armor. I don't know. I could have sworn I'd seen her up at Castle Alacair. Um, you think the constable would lock up a real Knight of the Flame? You have to admit, he has been acting strange lately. I'll admit I was surprised he broke up with Sabisa. She's gorgeous. I'll say. That's one forge I wouldn't mind firing up. I'd be careful you don't say that too loud. I heard Sabisa eh, was once there, quite not? a swordsman. Joel I'm map. just joking I'm a happily married man. You know, underneath all that steel, that knight actually has a pretty attractive Let's go. Hear ye, hear ye. Did you come here A for crafting from the certification? Just brought news that Camlorn has been liberated. I the really did. Vestige! You're the help the Skull King promised? Suddenly I feel a lot better about our chances. Still, this threat is bigger than King Yorin imagined. 
Oh, wait. The Ice Reach Coven. Witches operating in secret right under the Skald King's voluminous nose. And this isn't just the usual Reach mischief. Of that, I'm sure. I need to investigate, but I can't do it by myself. See, this is a confusing thing about this, is that you can literally do any of the um, uh, campaign stories in any order that you wish, but on the minus side, it gets to be confusing because I didn't notice when I first started the game. I started off and I actually did all this Ice Reach Coven stuff. Here she pops up asking about it. Help me locate the Coven and determine their ultimate intentions. Between the two of us, we can cover more ground and figure out the full extent of this threat. As long as the magic Euron's wizards gave me works as promised, that is. I've already done this. But, yeah. Let's see. Meet me in Stormhaven. The Skull King's scout spotted members of the Coven near the lumber mill at the Bankerai border by the Weeping Giant. We'll start there. As for the King Yorin sent me to look into a sudden barrage of storms in the Sea of Ghosts. At least two ships sank beneath the freezing waves. The Ice Reach Coven was responsible. I uncovered evidence suggesting they're planning an attack on the mainland. I'm not exactly sure. That's why we need to investigate. But if they have the ability to summon destructive storms on command, think of the damage they can inflict on towns and cities. Look, are you ready to go or do you need time to prepare? Oh, what the hell? Let's just still see where it takes us. Why not? Or maybe, maybe this is where I'm actually supposed to be. Story. Well, let's find out. Alright, big girl. Where you at? Travel to the lumber mill. No, oh, no, talk to Luris. Ah. I already did all the stuff that I was supposed to do. Now she just damn disappeared. <sighs> Confusing. Alright, so let's take it from the top. Eh, don't sort. Sort of some storm haven. Go to Riven Spire. All right, I'm getting some. Where's Raven Spire? Actually, they might have some quests there. Uh, uh, let's go. Feel free to chime in if any of you guys know what the hell I'm supposed to be doing. Okay, I think that's what I'm supposed to do. So where is that? She's here. 
Oh. <laughs> okay, what's up? This is the place. Can't say I know what Reach Witches would be doing here. But the Scald King Scouts have never sent me on a wild guard chase before. Let's see if the trek out here was worth it. I was getting to that. At Ice Reach, I picked up a couple of the medallions the witches were wearing, for further study by the Scald King's wizards. The wizards determined that magic was infused into the jewelry, but not its purpose. The Scald King's wizards added their own spell to the medallions. We each get one. Here. They're supposed to lead us to magic similar to what's contained in the medallions. Ice Reach magic. Wave it around and see what happens. Don't look at me. It's not like Nords are known for being great mages. So whatever the Scald King's wizards did may not work, or it well, neither could are explode. Regards. Hold up the medallion and see if you can make it work. Thanks to the Scald King's wizards, it should lead us to magic similar to what's contained in the jewelry. Ice Reach magic. Just take it out and give it a try. Sure. Why not? It actually worked! Follow that trail. I'll take the other one. The other trail? What other trail? Alright, I'll follow this one. Sorry about that interruption. Let's see what's going on here. Charge. Find anything? Damn, poor big ass woman, you're sure silent. You can see you. So, find anything that will help us locate the Ice Reach Coven? Always led to a similar sight. Damn witches! Whatever game the Ice Reach Coven is playing at, we need to put an end to it. Preferably with multiple swings of my axe. <sighs> Let me see the note you found. <sighs> That's no help. 
Luckily, Yorin's scouts provided a few locations of interest with their last report. Let me mark them on your map. When you reach each location, use the medallion and see where the magic leads. I'll catch up with you shortly. Alright. First ice storms, now fire. Keep your guard up. The Coven won't hesitate to kill anyone who gets too close.
Are you going up to the ruins? Well, yeah. All right, what? Your timing is impeccable. I'm on a critical mission for the Mages Guild, and I need assistance. These ruins contain a powerful relic, King Afrin's sword. With all the chaos... Oops, yeah, didn't mean to do that. Yeah, what were you saying? Your timing is impeccable. You're smarter than you look. Yes, I need to bring King Afrin's sword back to Wayrest. The Supernal Dreamers got here first, but it's actually a good thing. Their meddling awakened the spirits of this place, who killed every last one of them. Hmm. Right again. Complicating matters further, King Afrin's sword was shattered into three parts. Legend says it can only be reforged in King Afrin's tomb. If you're brave enough to find the pieces and get them reforged, there will be a reward. Sure, why not? I'm actually jealous, you know. I've always wanted to see the ruins of King Afrin's hold. All the stories I've heard about the sword, the hold, the king himself. I'd go along, but I have no stomach for fighting the spirits of the dead. My research suggests the three parts of the sword, the blade, the hilt, and the pummel can be found in the three towers within the hold. Only King Afrin's spirit can reforge the sword. You must take the pieces into the king's tomb. Sounds simple enough. Oh, that loud up. There are books about the subject, you know. We don't have time for a history lesson. To summarize, Afrin was a ruthless merchant king early in the first era. He conquered many of his neighbors. Quite infamous. There are no specific records of what occurred here, only vague references. King Afrin allegedly spent all his time at war. While he was away, his enemies apparently attacked Afrin's hold and killed everyone. The king himself died soon after. Okay, what's so special about it, though? King Afrin's sword was sacred. He never let anyone else touch it. We don't know how it was shattered, or even if it really has magical properties. It certainly sounds like it's worth studying, though. There are no specific records of what occurred here. Only vague references. King Afrin... Honestly, that was a surprise. I was told it was a quiet place. I presume it was the supernal dreamers who disturbed the dead. Perhaps because they sought the sword, or perhaps they were only trespassing. Either way, they're all dead. Okay. There are no specific records of what occurred here. Right, Only. Right, that's not what I want to do. So let's go back to the old.
straight ahead, but up there. That was unpleasant. When they came, they took us into the courtyard. I thought you Seriously? would rescue us. Uh. Where were you? Tower here, might as well get it. Hello, friend. Yeah, and get up off me. Get up off me! 
That sword. You loved it more than you ever loved me. It was shiny. Why, Father? Why did you abandon us? Why did you let us die? That's probably a very good question. Not even sure he knows the answer to that. Let's see what's up these stairs. Probably not.
I hope you're not giving up. I'm not going to reward you if you only have the pieces. The sword. Right. There you go. Pieces. <clears throat> oh damn! I gotta go in there. Not doing that. Later, gear. Come to us, Garzugar. The way is open. The way is clear. Come to us, Garzugar. Bring us terror. Bring us fear. Come to us, Garzugar. Yeah, um, no. Come to us, Garzugar. The way is open. The way is clear. Yeah, you keep doing what you're doing. Goblins! Oh, Goblins right must pay! What? You look pretty dangerous. Consider yourself drafted. There are goblins here that need killing. Bert? Why do you need me? Because the goblins killed my men. All of them. That's why the goblins have to pay. I want their heads! While you're at it, burn their territory markers, too. The watch will never be theirs. Not as long as I draw breath. Okay. Yes. You have a hearing problem. Territory markers. They use them to mark their territory. The goblins set them up at the North Tower, the South Tower, and the Eastern Gate. I'll stay and keep this gate secure. Well, sure. get on with it! Oh, fuck you, but... There the goblins. You got time for that? I wanna go to the party.
horrifying. Oh, 
All I did was provoke a showdown that was coming anyway. Tina, oh. get a bit up where you can chew. Ah, the smell of fresh goblin blood is like perfume to me. I knew I could count on you. Bit of a weirdo. Well done. And thanks for all the help. Uh, the commander here would like to have a word with you. Of all the boneheaded stunts. Oh. Ah, well, at least now we know what brought the stone chewer goblins down on us. Why? Captain Rama here stole one of the stone chewer's tribal totems and raised it on our tower as a challenge. They are honor bound to recover it, along with killing whoever took it. Okay. <laughs> what are you supposed to do about that? That totem needs to come down, and quick. I ought to send Rama, but it's probably smarter to keep him here under arrest. My troops are stretched thin. Can you run up and take down the totem? Bring it back here to me. Uh, I'm here, might as well do it. Why not? Captain Rama deliberately stole the totem to provoke the stone chewers. As long as that totem remains in the tower, we'll never be rid of those goblins. They just leave? Actually, why would he do that? He hates goblins. I mean, we all hate goblins, but he really hates them. I've asked why, but he won't say. Should have listened to my instincts and sent him to another post. Not without getting that totem out of here. They can smell it or something. Even then, we, we'll need reinforcements to take back the watch. I sent a request to Captain Ernard, but if he doesn't arrive soon, we'll just have to withdraw. Yeah. He hates goblins. Yeah, yeah. We oh. Well, a big mess he made. got to help me. Those goblins will eat me. Really? The watch soldiers threw me in here just before the goblins attacked. You've got to help me. Why? The soldier that locked me up headed towards the stables and took the key with him. Find him before the goblins find me. Hurry! Find the key! One of those dead soldiers might have it. Did you check them? Why are we locked up in the first place? It was all a mistake. I meant to pay for that chain mail. I really did. The Silvered Sword, too. I was just trying it out before making them an offer. Honest. I'm a legitimate businessman. I somehow doubt that. Oh. oh. 
Oh, you was about to get it. They can see it up here. I crawl goblin bullshit. So I ain't done it with that. Yeah, well, I ain't fucking with that. For myself. Like, he's having a good time with it. Ha Back with reinforcements, but I was too late to save the commander. Daedra, take it. Before yeah. he died, he said he'd sent you on a mission. I hope you succeeded. Now you've got to return that totem to the Stone Chewers. The Goblin Camp is to the west, but I'm not sure where the totem belongs. If I were you, I'd ask that crazy scholar who lives near the camp, Nelik Sterone. That's his name. Hmm. God damn it. Alright, fine. I shall return. So many tribes gone from High Rock. The rat farmers, the throat cutters, even the famous disembowelers. The stone chewers are really the last of the breed. Rat farmers? Sounds like a gang in a bad neighborhood in New York. Search the caves. The totem needs to be restored to the goblin's shrine. If a shaman sees you, expect some kind of trouble. One of them knows a shape-changing spell, and he's got a wicked sense of humor. Indeed. Look how busy they are. Carving femur flutes, skinning Durzog puppies, disciplining their females. So misunderstood. Like us, yet unlike. The goblins live in a world apart, one I may never enter. I can only dream. That doesn't sound shifty at all. No. Ah!
guys do your thing. Suckers. Expecting a big labyrinthine cave. This is like a little, a little depression. It all stress the depression. Alright. Are oh, you son of a bitch? Who, who cast that? Who did that?
<sighs> Might as well let him go. There's somewhere right here. Alright, you bloody thief. Did you find a key? There must be one around here somewhere. There it is. Thank Kenrith. I thought I'd get eaten by a goblin for sure. They debone you, then carve your thigh bones into flutes. It's true, I swear. Well, I'm not one to doubt you. I'm getting out of here. You just teleported. How did you? What? Is it done? Has the totem been returned to the goblins? Yep. Well done. You accomplished what we couldn't. Cumberland's watch is in your debt. We'll drive out the remaining goblins, but while we're doing that, Rama's just going to be getting farther away. Captain Rama has fled Cumberland's watch. His comrade's blood is on his hands. He must be brought to justice for his crimes. I don't really feel like chasing him right now, but I'll listen to you. One of my scouts saw Rama's cousin Harimal in the woods north of the Watch. Rama and his cousin are tight. I'll bet he knows where Rama has fled to. By the thousand scales of Oh shit, I only need to buy.
Lady Laurent sends her regards. Oh shit. She still has that insufferable Stibbins with her. That was cool. What of a cat? A giant cat was that? I want that. Hell's going on here? Hello, hello! This one has just the thing to put some swagger in your step for these festivities. Okay, what the May Jaziri interest you in a jug of the freshest, no, the finest, uh, no, the strongest swill our King Boar could ever ask for? What? Offer me pig piss? Oh, no, no, no. This one assures you her brew contains absolute minimum of pig saliva, Jonter. The crispest and sharpest cider this side of the reach. Jadziri will crush you a fresh batch if you help her acquire the right ingredients. Well, you see, handlers of the festival arena have collected... Nah, I'm good. You know, this seems to be popular with you guys. I got a job. like a quick battle to get the heart pumping but I'm surprised we haven't faced more opposition the coven must be preoccupied wasn't expecting to fight vampires though did you find anything interesting at the sites I marked on your map found a bloody note a blood fiend you don't usually run into them in this part of the world let me see the note huh there's that word again lucrative What's that about a simple ritual? Sounds like coven activity to me. Anything else to report? Uh, not really. I don't like the look of that. It feels wrong. The Skull King's mages will want to examine it. In the meantime, we need to figure out what the coven is up to. How do rituals, vampires, and blood fiends figure into their plan? Uh, yeah, where do we go next? Uh, just one. A note from a merchant named Gohearth Ironbelly. Found it on these vampires. Ironbelly is apparently supplying something the Coven requires, but the note doesn't go into details. It says we can find him at a Riften Inn, the Withered Tree. Well, mm. uh, I'm not ready to leave yet. Well, Our only lead is a note from a merchant named Gohar. Let's focus, let's head back 
let's focus on what we're supposed to be doing. Go to Rift. Our only lead is a note. Poor pretty cat. Do your trading here. Our only lead is a note from a merchant named Gohearth. Let's go to the Rift. To the Rifty Rift. said Iron Belly does business at the Withered Tree Inn. This way. Uh, I'll follow you. Once we spot Iron Belly, him. we'll follow from a distance until he leads us to the coven. This is the place. Let's head inside and finalize our plans. Squad it up. Oh. Iron Belly's note suggested he'd meet with the coven after he did some business in this inn. When he arrives, don't do anything to alarm him. We want the merchant completely at ease when he leaves to go rendezvous with the witches. Just mill about and try not to draw attention to yourself. Honestly, I'm more comfortable with the direct approach, but we need to play this carefully. Then when he leaves, he can lead us directly to the coven. Good lizard, I'll take a pint of your finest ale! And what have we here? You're a strapping lass. Let old Iron Belly buy you a drink or two. What do you say? Not interested. Not interested? Go hot, Iron Belly never takes no for an answer. Go away, little man, before I break you. I beg your pardon, but things will be different after that witch lives up to her promise. No handouts today! Get lost! Okay, fine.
I know who I just wish would be familiar. It's from the same place from uh, Skyrim, yeah. Never fails. Follow a rat, you wind up in a sewer. Up, lady. Why my sewers always smell so bad? God, when we find Iron Belly, I'm gonna cave in his head for dragging us down here. My armor will never be mistaken for a bed of roses, but sewer stink lingers like Thane Yagi around the meat hall. <laughs> what up? Check a couple things here. 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 Sorry about the delay. Why must you followed Iron Belly? I followed you. Come on, let's find that slimy merchant and see what he's doing down here. Yeah, sewers are always fun. Thieves and murderers aren't the only scum that inhabit the Ratway. The local Jarl keeps sealing the entrances, but it never stays closed for long. It would make a perfect lair for the Coven. Watch your step and try not to blunder into any traps. Haha, <laughs> you don't know me very well, do you? That's no, crazy. damn it. Sneaky bastard. He rigged the gate to lock behind him. Look, don't wait for me. Find Iron Belly. Oh, 
was good. That was good magic. Were you followed, Iron Belly? I thought I saw someone, Sister Barla, <laughs> but I lost them. And have the arrangements I requested been made? The flyers have been distributed. And your friend with the fangs? Busy, I'm afraid. You promised a vampire would turn me! Make good on our deal, or I'll report this to the Jarl! You will do nothing of a sort! Oh, oh shit. Fool outlived his usefulness. This one will be turned to a vampire. Jeez. Wasn't cool at all. Oh, let's see. Place is amazing. Wait, what happened? Dead. I hope Iron Billy told you something before you killed him. Was it me? So what happened? Did you get too close? Did he attack you? It wasn't me. Damn. That must have been one of the Ice Reach Coven witches. Any idea where she may have gone? That's not much to go on, but it's all we have. I'll meet you at the cart outside of town. All right, the cart's ready. Now tell me what else you found out down in the Ratway. Let me see that. Huh. Another lucrative opportunity. But this time we know where they're leading people. To an isolated inn somewhere in East March. Did you hear anything else that I need to know? Uh, vampires, apparently. A vampire? Working with the Coven? That would explain the strange blood fiends in the Ratway. We'll worry about that later. Right now we have to get to East March and find that witch. Oh, before we leave, take this. You earned it. Why, thank you. The cart will take us to the Grinning Horker in East March. Hop aboard and we can get along. I don't want to give the Coven any more of a lead than they already have. Okay. Answers, I hope. That's what you and the Scald King sent me to find, after all. The Witches of the Ice Reach Coven are definitely up to something. Luring unsuspecting folk with promises of wealth. We saw what happened at those ritual sites. Tempted yeah. to a desolate area in East March, most likely to be subjected to more of those strange rituals. If that doesn't scream danger, I don't know what does. 
Will you accompany? If you're ready sure. to travel to the Grinning Horker, climb aboard the cart. We'll be in East March before you know it. Good idea, but so far the pieces don't tell a complete story. We found evidence of the Coven luring people with promises of gold so they could experiment on them. Ritual items, vampires, and strange blood fiends. What does it all mean? What, in, what does it all mean indeed? What about that pike? I've seen similar totems, but nothing exactly like that witch pike. It disturbed me just to look at it. It appears to be a key component to their ritual, though the Scald King's mages will determine that for certain. The Ice Reach Coven consists of witches and warriors of the Reach loyal to their cause. I never saw a connection to vampires before. Maybe the bloodsuckers are hired help? Come on. Hopefully we'll learn more when we get to the Grinning Horker. You saw what I saw. Those feral creatures were near some of the ritual sites, and each site appeared to be a slightly different version of the ritual. Like they're trying to perfect it. Alright, let's go. Peace, Mark! We need to walk from here. Follow the path up the mountain. Hey, <laughs> you can walk in the big ass feet. Ah! Me. The place looks empty. Let's talk. Sure. Nothing waiting to impede our progress? No guards? No witches? Nothing. Just a lonely inn on a desolate hillside. If Iron Belly's flyer led us astray, we're gonna head back and kill him again. I expected answers. Iron Belly sent people here for a reason. They have to be someplace. If we don't pick up the Coven's trail, I'm not sure we'll find them again in time to stop whatever the witches have planned. Let's take a look around. Anything that points to what the witches are up to. We need to determine the full extent of the threat. Let's explore the inn and look for any clues as to what happened to the people they lured here. With luck, that may lead us to the Coven. All right, so see. let's see. I've never known a Nord to abandon a meal while there's still food on the plate. You calling them gravelicious? Look around for clues. Yeah. Bedrolls. For those who came for the lucrative opportunity. I wonder where they are now.
Fresh blood. It leads to that hatch. Great. The trail leads into the basement. Naturally. Let's see. Empty. That's not right. There must be a secret passage. See if you can find it. I knew there had to be a secret passage. Let's see where this goes. Oh, yeah. Let's see where this goes. Black Reach. How far down does this tunnel lead? One of the we Reach Witches? You. you have to help me. I'll take a look up ahead. We were in the Hawker, waiting for them to tell us how we were going to make a pile of gold. When they ordered us to go to the basement, one of us refused. They cut him. There was so much blood. Well, that sounds pleasant. When we saw the Reach Witches, a few of us tried to fight. I slipped away before anyone noticed. They're doing something terrible down here. Something monstrous. Please, you must help the others. And you need to destroy the Pikes. They're evil. Let's see, man. Have a disco ball. Look at it, my friend. I thought it was just an old legend, but it's real. It's real. What are you talking about? Black Reach. The world below Skyrim. Every Nord child hears the stories. How another world stretches beneath the Nine Holds. Each story is slightly different. Some talk about dwarven cities, others about terrible monsters or fabulous treasure. What else could it be? Whatever it is, it's a perfect hiding place for the Ice Reach Coven. We need to get down there and find the witches. We must put a stop to whatever evil the Coven is planning. Well, I agree with you. The poor man is frightened out of his mind. I'll escort him back through the tunnel to the Grinning Horker. Meanwhile, get down there and see what you can find out. If you see any witch pikes, destroy them. I'll catch up with you shortly. I'm just gonna fight you just because. Come here, friend. Shit. Hi. 
guys.
guys, man. Look at this. Somebody's been partying. I catch up with him. Shit, I can't do it. <gasps> Help! You must set us free! All of you, follow me. We'll sneak out once the coast is clear. Hold, friend. You need to hear what I have to say. Sure. Thank the eight you came along. We were next in line for the witch's ritual. Uh, please, I need to tell you what I saw. Okay, what did you see, my friend? I saw the witches put some poor sods into a circle, surrounded by evil-looking pikes. They chanted and called forth a strange black storm. It killed some, but turned most of the people into those harrow fiends. That's what Sister Belra called them. There's a dwarven ruin west of here. Sister Belra has been using that as her personal domain. If she's around, that's where you'll find her. Damn it. I should have known. That flyer was too good to be true. Yeah, it usually is. <laughs> Ask the people who, who, who like Derek Jackson. I needed work. A lucrative opportunity was too good to pass up. It seemed strange when they marched us into the basement. We tried to fight, but there were too many of them. Kralt got away, though, I think. I just hope he made it to safety. I'm glad to hear Harald made it. I'll wait for you to distract them before I try to get out of here. Hey, give Sister Balra a good thrashing, all right? I think she's in the Dwarven ruins west of here. Mm. Well, as you find out what is going on I got back as quick as I could. Other than a few skirmishes, I didn't uncover anything important. What about you? Tell me you found something. Two things I wholeheartedly approve of. I carved a path through a number of witches and vampires myself. Sure as bones there are a lot of these bastards. Anything else to report? Yeah. 
This is it. This must be what the Skald King is worried about. A ritual that produces harrow storms. Magic that turns people into a new kind of blood fiend. A harrow fiend. I wish I knew whose head I had to remove to stop this. Sister Balra? The same witch that killed the merchant back in Riften. I'd definitely like to get my hands on that one. Let's go. Right behind you, baby. Oh. Are you all right? Doesn't look all right, does he? That lying, manipulative witch. She stabbed me. <laughs> the rich witch, Sister Balra. We had a deal, but she dotted me. Listen, forget about me. I made a terrible mistake. I told her how to sneak into the Palace of Kings. No, I think the Skald King is in danger. Hmm. Balra said she had something planned for High King Yorin. Said I was loose and... Please, I think she means to kill the Skald King. You must save him. I never meant to endanger Skyrim. Oh. Idiot! Sells out the Skull King for a handful of gold. I mean, if you're poor, a handful of gold is nice. Assassinating the Skull King would be a terrible blow to Skyrim and the Pact, but I assumed the Ice Reach Coven had a grander plan than that. Nevertheless, we have to save Yorin. A deathbed confession? That tells me the Sentry believed he put the Skull King in danger. I can't take a chance when it comes to your safety. Back to the wagon. We leave for Windhelm at once. All right, let's go. The Palace of Kings, hurry. We must warn Yorin. The Palace of Kings, that's what the sentry said. Yeah. Doesn't look like anyone's on alert. Maybe we got here in time. King. Fresh Where from he? the warm southern lands, you smell of salt and sunshine. Even the great Lyrist Titanborn must know that. It's a matter of royal security. Royal security? Listen, you little fool! You talk to her. Titanborn thinks she is, demanding to see the Scald King. Whatever you and the half-giant think you found is irrelevant. The Scald King is safe inside the Palace of Kings. It's the most secure structure in all of Skyrim. Is it, though? <clears throat> hmm. Well, it's true that Sentry Darfel never arrived for his shift today. And High King Yorin is touring the palace, but that's supposed to be a secret. The Ice Reach Coven, you say? How highly irregular. But if this is true... King Yorin wanted to tour the lower levels. To check on the progress of the construction. He could be anywhere. 
Go inside and find him at once. I'll rally the guards and secure the palace. Now hurry! Yes, ma'am. Into the palace. Let's move! Hello. Ah, you got to do it. Tim, you're on the inside. You must find the Skull King. Why would the Coven and its allies need that? What's this? The lockpicks in a jewelry box? A lot of thieving going around here. Alright, who am I talking to? map details the distribution of troops throughout Skyrim. Look, they tore off the western holds. Okay.
That's right. There it is. Dungeons. Yorn wasn't up here, so let's search down there. Sure. King alone, witch. Yorin is ours. He will make a fine addition to our patron's forces. Wanted to turn me into a monster. I've had enough of this dungeon. Let's talk in the throne room. I would have too. <clears throat> I weapons.
That's my report, Skull King. Our friend can tell you more. Held captive in my own dungeon. If word gets out, I would be laughed off my rebuilt throne. And rightly so. On to business. <laughs> I heard Lyris is the report. Now tell me, what did you uncover? Yes, so Lyris mentioned. Harrowfiend, she called them. An ominous name. And that Sister Balra claims she was turning me into a monster? What else did you learn about the Ice Reach Coven? Vampires. I have known both decent and terrible folk burdened by that curse. I take it the ones working with the Coven fall into the latter category. Anything else? Hoffinger? High King Svargrim rules that hold from the City of Solitude. We don't see eye to eye, especially since neither of us oh, will openly okay. acknowledge no, the other's reign. Still, okay. he should be warned. Talk to Lyris, I have much to think about. <sighs> Svargrim and the people of Western Skyrim can be real pains in the arse, but they're still Nords. Despite the differences between their holds and ours, we won't abandon them to the Coven's conspiracy. All right, one sec. Gotta take a leak. Not so fast, friend. Western Skyrim doesn't exactly get along with Eastern Skyrim. Politics can be a tricky business, so I tend to leave that to the politicians. When King Yorin gives the word, then we go. Not before. Now we celebrate our victory and let Yorin's scouts do what they do best. Meanwhile, I'll work with the Skald King to figure out how to approach Svargrim with this news. In the meantime, take this. You earned it. I'll be in touch soon. This isn't over, not from what we learned of the Ice Reach Coven. 
For now, though, we rest, and let the Scald King make plans. There'll be plenty of time to kill more Reach Witches another day. There hasn't been a single ruler in over a hundred years. Jarl Svarter of Solitude refused to recognize Freydis as the legitimate heir. Ever since, the kingdom has been divided. Damn inconvenient at times like this. Joran rules over eastern Skyrim from Windhelm, while Svargrim lords over the western holds from his palace in Solitude. If the Ice Reach Coven has targeted western Skyrim, it will take both nations to stop them. If we can ever agree on anything. Train. Eat. Drink. Probably drink some more. But don't worry. I'll be ready when the Skald King gives the word. Then we'll move against the Ice Reach Coven. You have my word on that. Oh, didn't even realize I had this <laughs> not off. But yeah, this seems like a good um as good a place to um stop for tonight. I believe I'm back up to the spot where I initially started playing this game. And I think this yeah, this is the same place in Skyrim. We took down the other Dragonborn or the false Dragonborn, I think. Oh well. Anywho, this is good. Thank you very much, folks, and have a good night. I think I'll sit down here and uh, I'll sit down and eat. Turn you back to the food. <sighs> Fine. I'll just have a seat over here then. I can't. Lord, man, you guys got bad manners. Fine, I'll just sit here. Pretend I'm not hungry. Alright, well, thank you for joining the stream. And you guys have a good night.